Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to Oxygen Not Included with me, your host, Lucky Marine. Let's speed up time a little bit, shall we? Let's get stuff done. Let's get stuff done today. Mainly this. Or oh, let's also open this door. Alright, who's going to die? Ellie. Ellie might die today. We're opening up this chlorine. Right, cancel that and just leave. Alright, so chlorine, that is heavier than air. Heavier than a lot of things. Should be starting to make its way down. All this kind of orange should make its way down the shaft all the way to the bottom here. So when we see this being chlorine instead of carbon dioxide and contaminated oxygen we'll know it's safe to dig in this way to this but until then we'll let it do its thing we're only going there for the bleach stone which you use in the hand sanitizer all right how are we getting on with carbon dioxide yeah let's Get, let's get this up and running again. Done. And this air scrubber will get rid of all this carbon dioxide around us and pump it. It'll use nice water and turn it into icky water every now and then. Yep, but it'll also get rid of our carbon dioxide. That's fine. We're starting to have issues down here. We're starting to pant, so let's get rid of the carbon dioxide. Picking up gold. Like it. Yeah, you chlorine scary. We're not going over there. Has no one done this yet? Come on, it's unreachable. Why is it unreachable? How is it unreachable? I'll open this door. And then you can open this door. And then you can make this. How does it? Auto. Close. Auto. So now, stuff should be getting pulled out of where they sleep. end up sleeping in hydrogen and you don't want that so if we lay the hydrogen up into this cavity and we keep this door open it'll flood this chamber and it'll force itself up through this vent hopefully We got this all tunneled through. Like it. It's a lot of water to uh, to pump our way through. Okay. Decent amount of icky water. Like it. Ah, oh, you're not in water, are you? Do we go deeper? Do we go deeper? Let's try. We can only see what's there. 
Uh, let's make it out of sandstone. Oh no! So close. I can hear some really strange noises down here. Is it just the water? I hope it's just the water. Let's cancel you. Is that chlorine? Yup. Has the chlorine dropped to the bottom of here yet? Yup. Is it out of here yet? Mm, not all the way. There's only tiny pockets of it now though. Alright. So who's having issues? Doris, Ellie, Metrona. I still don't know her name. Metrodora. Doris, Ellie, yep. And we're having issues with power generation. Carbon dioxide has been abated. So let's deconstruct the liquid pipe here and disable you. If you don't stop the water from getting into it, it turns off, but it still pumps some water in, and we, we don't want that. That's just a waste. Alright, looks like we're getting our bedroom sorted out. Alright, we're getting hydrogen up here now. That's good. Should work his way into here and then up through this vent. Gradually, gradually. Oh, day 115. 115. Let's have a look for any other bodies of water. A little bit of gold, a little bit of contaminated water over there. A little bit of water up here. This looks promising. Let's send an exploratory shaft up that way. And also let's dig out a little bit more coal. Let's break into here. This is chlorine again. Damn you chlorine. We'll get some of this bleach stone and make a hand sanitizer. That'll help him out a little bit with the stress. Wow, Doris, you not, you not getting rubbed? You go get rubbed. Pierre as well. About twenty percent stress on them to be. Uh, yeah. Doris. Yep, Doris is up at 62. Yeah, you get you get de stress. Do we have enough for a hand sanitizer just yet? Not yet.
We get down, Doris. Down at 52, that's a lot better than what you were. Still don't know what to use this space for. Let's harvest these lot. Dig up, even, sorry. I'll harvest you and then we'll dig you up. And I'm gonna I'm gonna dig up all these plants, and then I'm gonna leave this algae down, and we're gonna test out to see if plants just spawn out of algae that's on the floor. If that's so, we'll just leave this algae down, and it'll be a constant source of seeds for uh, for what we need for food. Not that we're not that we're uh, lacking for food. Insufficient oxygen generation. I doubt it. Athletics is now at 20. Wow. Alright, oh, yep. Yeah. Let's dig that up. And then let's sweep you up. Alright. This other bedroom is clear of hydrogen now, which is nice. We will get rid of this tile. Looks like hydrogen's hitting this and then seeping through into here. Replace it with a granite. Plenty of fluid there. Uh, yeah, we're losing a little bit of hydrogen, are we? Let's try to contain it. Damn you! And you shake your hands. <laughs> oh, we'll put that ladder. Just there so they can get up and take that out. Alright. There's no point having a hydrogen generator if we're going to leak out all the hydrogen to another cell, as it were. You've got to consider these as almost enclosed cells. So what's down here? It's carbon dioxide. This is contaminated oxygen, but we've we've closed it off. And we're sorting out anything that comes through with the uh, deodorizer. This is all hydrogen. Right, let's turn this on again. Alright. Get some hydrogen generation sorted out. That'll also do us a favour of eating through a lot of this hydrogen buildup. No, thank you. Everyone's sleeping a lot better now, which is nice. I can't imagine waking up in the middle of the night because you can't breathe. Is uh, is too pleasant. Marie, Ellie, no, just Marie and Ellie. All right, Ellie, Marie. Off you go. Can we make yet a hand sanitizer? No, I can't. How much of this damn bleach stone do we need? Contaminated oxygen. That's alright. As long as it's not chlorine, I'm fine. The chlorine should have dropped all the way down. Yeah, it's just contaminated oxygen. That's fine. 
Now I can properly get in there and dig out all this bleach stone. this as well. <laughs> Don't need that anymore. Stresses are coming down. Lots of food. Quite a lot of algae actually. Decent amount of slime. Which can we can turn it into algae. Consumable ore. Only twelve kilograms of bleach stone. So when we get to 50, we can make a hand sanitizer, which will help. It'll help a little bit. Yeah, I know you're having troubles, but you'll be right. Oh, I just vent in all this hydrogen into you now, aren't we? Well done, Darren. Well done. Suffocating. Uh, cause you can't get out of here anymore, can you? Can you? How? Right, come down here and deconstruct this. Just the building. Deal with this tomorrow. Just get yourself to bed. All right. Who's self getting? Who's self getting? Hydrogen does make its way into here, but now it, it can vent out. Wow, that took a while. It's a very strange airlock. Very, very strange. You digging stuff? Hmm, kind of. Do we have enough for a bleach stone yet? For a hand sanitizer? We do. Let's make it out of... Gold. Deco plus 10. Wow, really? So where are we where are we struggling struggling for decor in the toilets? Where else would you put a hand sanitizer? Hmm. Let's put it here, next to the table. One of pure gold amalgam. Which is a, a mixture of gold and mercury, I believe.
All right. How's the water up here? There's a decent amount of it. It's just kind of, if we can, yeah, let's dig across. We'll vent this into this, which already feeds up on. Then we'll dig this into this, and this into this, and this across. Yeah. And then once all this is out, we will. Continue. Upwards. Hmm. Let's leave a little bit of a gap between us and this. We have been surprised by things like that before. Alright, so that's going to be our vent into the top here. We'll put a manual. Yeah, there has to be a point where the the shaky hand works for something. I'm putting it, putting the airlock above here, and having the tile, a solid tile underneath means that as they're traversing it through this airlock they're not going to be letting any of the contaminated water out because it'll it'll butt up against this tile a bit like the airlocks that you have when you're on well if you're on ship if you're on if you're on the type of ship that i've been on then it's bulkheads and you have to step through them like over a huge lip it's like just a, a hole cut in a metal wall with a door on it and so if you get water in that compartment it doesn't spill through to the next one as soon as you open the door it's got you know it's got to be at least three feet of water in that compartment before it'll get through it'll leak through the door all right so that's our so that we can turn this into a giant drain pipe and drain all these water bodies into this area which will flow into where we have our pump and we'll once these are empty we can then go further up and see if we can expose any more water up there uh, same again up here uh, we'll, we'll come up here we'll, we'll see how much water there is in this area of the map and try and link it through to this waste pipe maybe even this waste pipe uh, and, and get it get it into our waste water tank all right anyway from me and the gang who needs the uh, Doris Pierre and Metrodora let's get them sorted out now Metrodora Pierre and Doris all right Ooh, and the hand sanitizer. They'll all use it before you get in the mail. Alright. What's that done for the decor around the place? Oh yeah, they love this. Total decor 34 from Masterpiece, from a hand sanitizer. We might also get some of these sculpting blocks. That looks good. So the places where they're going to spend time. On the massage tables. In the bedroom. Whilst they're eating. They are all uber deco. And that's fine. That, that's really good. Uh, we're going to get the most bang for buck there. There's no point in randomly chucking decorations around down here. Because they might see it for three seconds during a, an entire day it, it's not efficient you might as well have the deco concentrated in the areas where they're going to be for a long period of time so 
from me and the gang. It is a uh, good night, and we will see you in the next episode. Alright, do you take care?